said to meet here. Oh, Pandy Paws, where are you? <laughs> Do you see Pandy? <laughs> Hug a jack! <laughs> Whoa! Uh oh! Mud! I'm having an unlucky day! What's wrong, Pandy? Earlier today I lost my pack, so I went to the garden to cheer myself up and find a kitty dragonfly! But it flew away before I could take a picture! And now I've stepped in mud and gotten dirty! Oh, that's okay, Pandy. You haven't had a very lucky day yet! But we can change that! Okay, well, what should we do? We'll start with a spa party in the bathroom. Let's go visit Mercat. Great idea, Gabby. To the bathroom. Hi, Mercat. Hi, Gabby. Hi, Pandy. Oh, shimmering sea scales. Were you two playing in mud? Well, actually, I accidentally fell into a mud puddle. And now I'm all covered in it. Let's get you cleaned up. I just developed a deluxe spa treatment I've been wanting to try out. Wow, perfect timing. You might even say we're lucky. Fall <laughs> <laughs> time! Woohoo! Whoa, look at my fur. It's all clean. It's so soft and shiny. Aw, oh, Pandy, you look great. And I feel awesome. Now that you're clean, let's go try to find the kitty dragonfly in the garden and take a picture of it. Do you really think it's still there? There's only one way to find out. Thanks for the spa treatment, Mercat. You're welcome. Good luck in the garden. Yes, that's what we need. Good luck. See you later. Bye. Where could the kitty dragonfly have gone? Do you see a kitty dragonfly? Hmm, I don't see a kitty dragonfly. But what's a banana doing here? Hey, that's my banana from my missing pack. But I don't see my pack. Do you see anything else from your pack lying around? Hey, that's my sandwich. These are all snackies from my packy. Do you see anything else that might have come from Pandy's pack? What's that, Pandy? It's a pickle. It also came from my pack. And that's a pencil. Let's follow the trail. Maybe they will lead to my missing pack. Oh, look, my Frisbee. And there's your pack, Pandy. Whoa. Whoa. Meowzers, the kitty rabbit's stuck. Let's help it. It's okay, little kitty rabbit. Aw, I think the kitty rabbit was after my carrot snacks. I must have left my pack in the garden while searching for the kitty dragonfly. And then the rabbit smelled the food inside. Here you go. <laughs> I think the kitty dragonfly is also drawn to the food. Look. Look at that. Oh, boy. I got it on camera. Great job. By losing your pack, you were able to get a picture of the kitty dragonfly. Mistakes can sometimes bring wonderful things, too. It's your lucky day after all. It is, because I have a podtastic friend by my side to help me and comfort me when I'm feeling down. Aw, thanks, Pandy. I'm always here for you. Hug attack! <laughs> <laughs> Hi, Baby Box. Oh, hi, Gabby. Hi, Pandy. Hmm, maybe you can help me. Sure, what's up? I want to craft something special for Mama Box to thank her for being such a good mama. But I don't know what to make. You don't know what to make yet, but we'll help. What about a heartfelt card? Then you can write a nice message inside to her. What a crafty rific idea! She would love a card. Why don't we all make a card for someone who means a lot to us? Awesome! I can't wait to make one. What does Mama Box like, Baby Box? A personalized card is a perfect way to show someone you care. Hmm. Mama Box loves crafting, the kitty rangers, and me. <gasps> oh, I know! I'll make my card in the shape of a kitty face. A kitty card. We'll make kitty cards, too. Let's get crafting. For this kitty card craft, you'll need a pencil, construction paper, safety scissors, glue, and markers. 
Fold your paper in half. Start at the folded side and draw almost a full circle. You'll need to leave space at the edge when you cut your card so your card can fold. Now with a grown-up's help, cut the card out with safety scissors. With your extra paper, cut out two triangles to make kitty ears. <laughs> and glue them to your card. Boop. And boop. Now you're ready to draw your kitty face. If you want, you can add glitter, pom-poms, or anything else you'd like. My card is going to look like me. Even the ears look similar. a rainbow kitty card. Its ears, whiskers, eyes, nose, and mouth are all in different marker colors. We made our kitty cards. Easy peasy, mac and cheesy. Now we write our heartfelt message inside the card. Hmm, what should I write to Mama Box? I want my message to rhyme. We'll help you, Baby Box. How do you want it to start? Dear Mama Box, I love you every day. That's great, Baby Box. Now let's think of what the word day rhymes with. Do you know what rhymes with day? Say! Play! Way! Oh, way is a great word, Gabby! It gives me an idea! Dear Mama Box, I love you every day. You're always helping me find my way! <laughs> Fantastic rhyme, Baby Box! Thank you for caring for me. Oh, hmm. What word rhymes with me? Can you think of some words that rhyme with me? C. Tree. We. B. And don't forget Pandy. Of course, Pandy Paws. Oh, thank you for caring for me. You helped me grow and be the best that I can be. Love, Baby Box. <laughs> I did it! I made my message rhyme. Thanks for your help. You're welcome, Baby Box. I already wrote my message in my card. It's for you, Pandy. I made my card for you too, Gabby. You're the best friend ever, Gabby. Thank you for being there for me and giving great hugs. Aw, I love our hugs, Pandy. And I love this card. Hug attack! <laughs> 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 what a heartfelt and crafty terrific idea. Now it's your turn. I can't wait to see what kind of kitty card you'll make. Be sure to give your card to someone you love. Bye! See you later! Bye! Okay, who's ready to bakey with cakey and make their personalized pizza cat pie? Me! Yummy! Mmm! I can't wait! Hey, what's this? Is this a special topping? That's a special ingredient, cat rat! Kitty Fairy gave it to me! It makes everything it touches bigger! Cool, I just want to take a sniff. <clears throat> this lid's hard to get off. <clears throat> Whoa, that's a big tomato. How are we going to make pizza with all these big ingredients? I know how. Oh. <laughs> Whoa, yay! <laughs> We're going to be big too. Oh. oh, it will be fun to be this size for a while. Now we can make our big pizzas! Yay! Oh, yeah! Let's start by rolling out our dough into kitty faces. You can also spin and toss your pizza dough in the air to stretch it out. <laughs> Tail flip! What's next, Cakey? Spread out your sauce. I'm using tomato sauce, but you can make whatever sauce you like. White garlic sauce for me. 
I'll use barbecue. Pesto is perfect for me. I'll smother mine in hot sauce. Hacha! Next, spread a layer of cheese all over and cover with whatever toppings you want to eat. Because we're making pizza cats, we'll make the toppings look like a cat face. Oh, wow! Yummy! No cheese for me, thanks. Ooh! up on the big magic. I hope everyone saved room for dessert. Because surprise, I made dessert pizza. Oh yeah. Thank you, Cakey. It's so cute. I'll just add some hot sauce to mine. Cat rat. <laughs> <laughs> now that was some spa science. Mercat, are you all right? I was playing with a ball and it bounced into the dollhouse. I'm good, thanks. I was doing a little spa science when the ball bounced into the house. I felt a little shake and I dropped my potion. Ooh, what kind of potion? Oh, a mix and match potion. I think the dollhouse got mixed. Look. <gasps> Where did my mirror table go? What's going on? I was playing with Carlita sliding down the slide in the playroom and now I'm in a tub? No one told me this was a water slide. I dropped my potion, Cat Rat, and it caused the dollhouse to get all mixed up. Hi, everyone. The strangest thing just happened. What is it, Kitty Fairy? I was watering my flowers and they just, poof, disappeared. Oh, Bubbles, more mix up from the mix and match potion. Here, this potion is just a match potion. It will put the dollhouse back in order. Let's give it a go. Let's check out the other rooms to see what else is mixed up in the dollhouse. Bye. See you later. See you later. Whoa! Hey, flowers! Get ready to wiggle those stems! We found Kitty Fairy's flowers! Hi, DJ Catnip! The flowers would love to hear some music, but right now, they need to get some sun and get back to Kitty Fairy. Anytime they need to rock their petals, just let me know! <laughs> Let's get you all back to the garden! Still need to find Murcat's mirror table. Let's go check all the other rooms. This isn't a mirror table. This is Baby Box's craft table in Pillow Cat's bedroom. That is a mix up.
<laughs> oh, why did this get here? Hi, Baby Box. We're helping get all the items back to their places. The dollhouse was mixed up by one of Murcat's potions. Now to match the mirror and table with the room it belongs in. The bathroom. Let's check the kitchen next. Huh, everything looks normal. We fixed it all. That's great to hear. I was about to box up this pie. Pillow, Pillow cat. cat. Oh, did I sleep through story time? Why am I sleeping in Cakey's kitchen? You didn't miss story time, but you missed a mixed up dollhouse afternoon. <laughs> <laughs> it's time to come back in. Hi, Murcat. What are you up to? Hi, Gabby. Hi, Pandy. I'm trying to get my rubber duckies to return from their swim in the ocean. They're having so much fun, but it's time to come home. We'll help you gather the duckies. Yeah, I've never herded rubber duckies before, but let's give it a go. Hey, my duckies are fast swimmers. To find them, I think you're going to need the help of one of my new potions. Whoa! A mermaid tail! Fishtail five! Awesome! <laughs> let's go collect those rubber duckies. Yeah! Mermaid Gabby and Mer Pandy, this is exciting! I'll come too. Dive in, everyone! Whee! I'm flipping for this new tail! How many rubber duckies do we need to find, Mercat? Three! There's one! Oh no! I'm stuck! Is that better, Pandy? Woo! Yeah, thanks! We have one rubber ducky! And here's the second one! Hmm. Now where's the third? I need to time this right in order to bring this rubber ducky home. Open, closed, open, closed, open. Hi, ducky! The last one! Now let's go home safe and sound! You had quite the sea adventure, didn't you? Here, duckies, you can swim in the tub. This potion will turn you back. I'm back to me with legs. I'm back to Pandy with legs, which helps me do this. Hug attack! Oh, Pandy. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, Kitty Fairy. Hey. Hello. Hey, Kitty Rangers. I'm so glad you could come. Of course. The Kitty Rangers are ready to help with any task. I've been so busy lately, and I could really use some help in the garden. I made a checklist of some plant and insects I want to make sure are taken care of. It's a garden checklist. Yes. Do you think you'll be able to complete these tasks? The Kitty Rangers have it covered. Flowerific! Thank you! See you later! Audacity! <laughs> Kitty Rangers! Woo! Meow, 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 meow! The first item on the checklist is to water the apple tree. Whoa, there's a lot of fruit trees here! Which one is the apple tree? Hmm... Here's the apple tree! And here are some watering cans! Horrific! <laughs> there, the water will help it grow big and strong. Awesome! What's next on the list? Kitty Fairy would like us to look after the glitter butterfly. It loves to be pet and scratched under the chin. Hmm, I don't see a glitter butterfly anywhere. Where could it be? Pom poms and polka dots! Look at all this glitter on the ground! That must be a trail left by the glitter butterfly, baby box. Let's follow it. Oh, snippets. The trail stopped. That's because the butterfly is over our heads. Hi, glitter butterfly. <laughs> How are you doing? Would you like to be pet? 
Oh, a glitter shower! A uh, meowzing! I love your sparkle, glitter butterfly! <laughs> Only one more item on the list. We need to find and play peekaboo with the peekaboo plant. Hmm. Do you see it, Pandy? I'm not sure what to look for, but I can't find it! Yet! We haven't found it yet, but let's keep looking. How's it going, Kitty Rangers? Good! We're trying to find the peekaboo plant. Oh, yes! The peekaboo plant is very shy, but it likes to come out when it hears you playing peekaboo. Its favorite game! Use these as blindfolds to play the game. You're doing very amazing! Okay, let's play peekaboo! 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 Hmm. Did that do anything? Let's all three play peekaboo at the same time. You can play with us. Cover your eyes and then peek out and say peekaboo. On the count of three. One, two, three! Peekaboo! Cardantastic! <gasps> you found a peekaboo plant! Check it off your list! We completed the checklist! Yay! Congratulations, Kitty Rangers! Here's a garden badge for each of you! Terrific! Yay! Woo! Aw, I think it wants to play again! Peekaboo! <laughs> Thanks for helping us, Kitty Rangers! <laughs> Bye! <laughs> Cupcakes in the box! Pie in the box. Cake. Cake? Oh, sprinkles! I forgot to decorate this cake! Hi, Cakey. Can we help you bring the treats to Mercat's spa party? Gabby! I forgot to decorate the cake! We can help with that! Easy peasy, lemon squeezy! Okay, let's decorate! We want to make the cake look like a beach! An ocean theme? Mercat's gonna love that! How can we get started? We need to dye some of this white icing blue, like ocean water! Is this the right blue? Yeah, that's my food coloring! Squirt in the color and mix it in! You can decorate a cake like this too! We'll show you how! First, set out all your ingredients! Scoop some white icing out and save for later. Then squirt the blue food coloring and stir into the icing until it's all mixed in. <laughs> Spread the blue icing all over your cake. So it will look like the ocean? You got it! Next, you'll need a jar of blue edible glitter. <laughs> What's that for? To give the ocean shimmer and sparkle! This shimmers like Mercat sea scales! <laughs> what? You have blue icing on your ear. Oh, oops! <laughs> <laughs> now we make sand colored icing with yellow dye to make it really look like a beach. Oh no! I don't have yellow! How are we going to make our cake look like a sandy beach? <laughs> That's okay, Cakey. We haven't figured it out. Yet! Let's have a look around and see what you have that we could use instead. Let's check the fridge! Hmm, cucumbers, carrots… A jar of leftover pizza sauce… Hey, what's that on top of the fridge? Graham crackers! Ooh! Mashed up graham crackers could be our sand! How do we make them into sand? You put them into a bag and squish them into crumbs. Are you ready to squish with us? Make sure your bag is sealed shut. Then squish, squish, squish. Squish, squish, squish. Squish, squish. <laughs> squish and scrunch. Squish, squish and scrunch. scrunch. Once it's crumbly like sand, sprinkle it on one side of the cake. Just a few more ocean touches. Let's use the leftover white icing to make waves in the blue water icing. And then we can add a little paper umbrella decoration. <laughs> Yay! 
It's beautiful. Whew. Thank you for helping me. Kanky, do you have any cucumbers for the spa party? I ran out of cucumber slices for our eyes. <gasps> oh, this looks like my favorite beach. Surprise, Mercat! A wave of applause for another fabulous dessert creation. It looks like Mercat's favorite beach and tastes like sweet sunshine. <laughs> 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 Gabby, Pandy, good morning. Thanks for coming to help me. What do you need help with, Kiki? <sighs> yeah, so early in the morning? It's a breakfast surprise to thank everyone for taste testing my recipe. Will you help me bake toast, eggs, and pancakes before everyone wakes up? I took a while making sure I had all the ingredients, and now I'm running out of time. I love breakfast. And a breakfast that's a surprise is fantastic. We're glad to help you, Kiki. Where do we start? With flipping eggs sunny side up. Like this? Yes! Great flip! Handy, can you mix the pancake batter in this bowl with this whisk? You got it! I'm a whiz at whisking. Meowsers! Maybe a little too much whisking? That's okay. This is happening in the kitchen. We can clean it up later. For now, let's keep mixing. Here, Pandy, I have more batter. Try again. Let's all three whisk together. Whisk it around and around. Whisk it with this sound. I'm keeping it in the bowl now. Can you set the table with 10 plates, Gabby? Of course. Okay, Pandy, the pancakes are ready to flip. I've got this. Whoopsie, let me try again. Oh no, I can't see with the pancake on my head. Oh no, I'll get another mixing bowl. Hmm, 10 plates. But count with me. One, two, Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten plates. Oh, what's that noise? Let's finish up. It's almost breakfast time. Pandy, can you flip the last pancake? Are you sure? The last one's flipped away from me. Remember the saying. Keep, keep baking, baking till it's better. better. Yeah, Kiki's rooting for you. <laughs> Woohoo! I did it! <laughs> Great job. I'll put the pancakes on the plate. Gabby, can you grab the syrup and jelly from the fridge? Sure. I'll help. Toast is ready. We did it. Look at that. Twinkle and tie pools. Mm -mm, yum. Glitterific. Hi, everyone. Mmm, it smells yummy in here. I thought I heard a noise. That's because we were making breakfast as a big thank you for taste testing all recipes. A breakfast surprise. Aw, shimmering sea scales. Thank you. Oh, no. I forgot the butter in the fridge. I'll get it. Oh, looks like I got a breakfast surprise of my own. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> hmm, I don't see it in here. Whee! Hi, Gabby and Pandy. What are you looking for? Gabby can't find her kitty camera. Oh, what's that? It's a picture of Cat Rat. He must have my camera. That looks like the craft room. Maybe Cat Rat is there. Let's go look. Hi, Gabby. Hi, Pandy. Hi, Carlita. I just decorated all these pictures of us together on one page. 
Look, there's me! There's Cat Rat again! But in this picture, he's in a different room. He's next to a blue kitty lamp. Pillow Cat's bedroom! To the bedroom! I'll come too! Great! Hi, Pandy! Hey! Hello! Oh, hi there! Hi, Gabby! Hi, Pillow Cat! We're looking for my camera, and we think Cat Rat has it because we found two pictures with him taken on it. Hmm. Let's look. Nothing here. No photos in here. Do you see a photo anywhere? Oh, I found the photo. Thanks. Hmm. In this photo, Cat Rat is surrounded by bubbles? He must be in the bathroom. Hi, Mercat. Oh, hi there. Hey. Shimmering sea scales. Did I forget about a spa party? We're looking for my camera, and we think Cat Rat has it. Did Cat Rat leave any photos behind? I don't know. Let's all look. No photos in here. Hmm, nothing here. Did Cat Rat leave a photo in the tub? Woohoo! It's right next to the top! Ooh, Cat Rat's standing in front of something very colorful. That's the wallpaper in Kiki's kitchen. You're right! Okay, team, let's go! This is going to be so delicious for your music party! Yes, I can already tell my taste buds are gonna boogie! Hi, everyone! What a sweet surprise! Hi, Kiki! Hi, DJ Catnip! We're looking for Gabby's camera, and we think Cat Rat has it. He's left a photo in every room, and this is the last room, so we're close to finding both. I'll help search. Kiki's rooting for ya. I'm about to put my cake in this box, then I'll help out too. Hmm. Hmm. Did Cat Rat leave a photo? <laughs> Do you see a photo anywhere? Found something. Here, Gabby. It's dark. It's hard to tell where Cat Rat is. Wait a minute. Cat Rat, is that you? Correct. <laughs> you found Cat Rat. <laughs> Pretty neat game, huh? Yeah. We had an amusing time working together to find you. You can't spell a meowsing without me. <gasps> Let's take a photo with all the Gabby cats. Follow me. Kitty Fairy. Come join us for our group photo! Leaping lilies! Here I come! <laughs> what is it, Gabby? Looks like Floyd wanted to be in the picture, too! <laughs> <laughs> Hi, Cat Rat! Hi, Gabby! Hi, Pandy! Check out this paper mailbox I taped together for Baby Box's craft show! I went to the different rooms of the dollhouse for design inspiration! See? Is the drawing of the cupcake inspired by the kitchen? Yes! I drew a music note for the music room and a slide for the game room. That looks awesome! We already dropped our crafts off. We'll see you at the show? Yeah, see you there. Let's see if Cakey needs help bringing snacks for the craft show. Great idea, Gabby! Uh-oh, I'm stuck! I've stepped on tape and can't move! Tape? Cat Rat must have left some tape behind while making his craft. Mm, uh, whew, thanks, Gabby! Help! Help! Let's go help Cakey! Help! I'm stuck to the floor! Hi, Cakey! We'll get you unstuck! Woo! Thank you! More tape! Cat Rat accidentally left tape behind while making his craft. He was in here drawing on his paper mailbox. He said he was going to the music room next. Uh, could any cat lend a helping hand? Oh no! I think DJ Catnip also is stuck. Let's go. I'll see you at the craft show. I'm bringing cookies. Ooh, yum! To the music room. Hey, Gabby. Hey, Pandy. It seems like some tape has stopped my groove. We're here for you, DJ Catnip. Thank you. Oh, no. Didn't Cat Rat draw one more image on his mailbox? Hmm. Let me think. Oh, it was a slide. The game room. 
that's the last room that Cat Rat visited. Let's go check on Carlita. To the game room! <laughs> Carlita! <laughs> Hi, Gabby. Hi, Pandy. My wheel seems to really be stuck on something. It's like I drove into a mound of mud. We'll give you a push. Honking horns, I'm free! Thank you! Now we can go to the craft show. <laughs> Woohoo! This is fun. Hey, cool cats. Look at that! Yay! Fantastic! <laughs> Welcome to the craft show! Hey, what took you so long? We were helping others get unstuck from tape left on the floor. Who would leave tape? Oh, oopsie! Oh! Wow, Mercat, I love your paper boat! Ah, <sighs> thanks, Gabby. But it ripped a little while I was playing with it before the craft show. Some tape will patch up your boat. <gasps> That's a whale of an idea, Cat Rat. Ha cha! There, tape came in handy here. <gasps> Thank you, Cat Rat. Cat Rat, look, you have mail. It's a letter. You are such a creative and helpful friend from Gabby. Ha ha ha, thanks Gabby. It's good to see my mailbox in action. Anyone else want to send a letter? Feel free. Oh, cat rat. <laughs> <laughs> Once we make our superhero capes and superhero masks, we'll be ready to fly. Yeah, super pandy to the rescue. And I've got super bubbles. Like I always sing, when you're stuck and you've got trouble, bubble, bubble, bubbles. And Super Baby Box will craft our way out of any problem. Okay, how do we make the capes and masks? Let's get crafting! First, use your safety scissors and cut towards the top of your cape on each of the long sides of the fabric. Then, cut half a circle out at the top of the cape. That's how you can fit it behind your neck. Now put a piece of sticky Velcro on each side. For your mask, cut out the shape you want. First, draw out your mask. I'm doing a rectangle shape. Use safety scissors to cut out your mask. Then, cut out the two circles for your eyes. Then, hole punch a hole on each side of the mask. Knot some elastic. Thread it through the holes. And you're done! We did it! I made my cape and mask pink. I chose orange for mine. I went with the color green for my costume. And my cape and mask are blue. Now we're ready to save the day. Shimmering sea scales, that was quite a breeze. Is everyone okay? Yeah, just blown around is all. Our superhero costumes got jumbled up. Well, let's sort them out. We can do it. There's your green cape, Mercat. Super. Now where could my green mask be? Do you see Meerkat's green mask? There it is. Spectacular! Thanks for your help! I found the orange and blue capes! Whee! <laughs> the pink mask is mine, so the blue mask is for... Me! I made a blue costume! I remember now! Baby box, you found my pink cape! I did? Oh yeah, I guess I did! I'm still missing my orange mask. Let's look. Mm, not here. Hmm. If I were an orange superhero mask, where would I be? Look, up on the ceiling. 
Of course, up high, flying like a superhero. It must have gotten some glue on it and got stuck. I can't reach it. I can't be a superhero without my mask. What? No! You are Super Pandy. We all are. Let's get that mask. But how? We built some stairs. Grab a box. And then we flip them over and stack them up and get that mask. <gasps> we have a superhero mission now. <laughs> Crafting is the work of superheroes! All ready! Here I go! Super Pandy is back in action! Thanks, fellow superheroes, for your help! The superheroes save the day again! Let's suit up! Yay! Yes. <laughs> Yay! Yay! <laughs> <laughs> Whoa! Yeah, we have some yeah, super yeah, friends, yeah. don't we? Hi, Pillow Hi, Cat. Hello, Pillow Cat. Hey, everyone. What story are we going to hear today, Pillow Cat? It's called Gabby and the Beanstalk. Let's get changed in the dress up closet. I wonder what I'll wear. Hi, dress up closet. May we come in? Here's the hat I'm looking for. Ta-da! Ha-ha! <laughs> I'm ready to grow a beanstalk! Ho-ho! <laughs> Wait for me! Ha-cha! All right, everyone, koodle up! This is the story of Gabby and the beanstalk. Once upon a time, Gabby and Pandy tended to their garden hoping to grow lots of vegetables. No matter how much we water, our plants aren't growing, Gabby. Let's keep trying. What should we plant next? How about some beans? Beans? Uh, not just any beans. Magic cloud beans. Wow, never heard of those before. Let's give it a go. How long do we have to wait for them to grow? Whoa! Whoa, what's going on? You just grew a magic beanstalk. Come on! <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> Woohoo! <laughs> Catastic! Woohoo! You can jump right on the clouds. They're garden clouds, and they hold all kinds of things like cloud carrots. <laughs> Whoa, that came from the cloud. Cloud gardens make delicious veggies. Cloud celery? It's so fresh. <gasps> and cloud cucumbers. Pick as much as you want. But little did they know, there was a giant cloud bunny. Hey, those aren't yours. You're right. Could we trade you something for them? Trade? Have you ever had veggie noodle soup? Hmm, veggie noodle soup? It's so delicious with all the flavors in one bowl. We'd love to make you some. Yeah, we'd love to make you some. Veggies and noodles? A taste sensation. Soup it is. We didn't have a bowl big enough for you, giant cloud bunny. So you get to have yours from a giant pot. This isn't just veggie noodle soup. It's cloud veggie noodle soup. What do you think of the soup, giant cloud bunny? Cloud veggie noodle-tastic! <laughs> <laughs> and the giant cloud bunny let Gabby, Pandy, and Cakey pick all the cloud vegetables they wanted and help them grow vegetables in their own garden, too. The end. What was that? Oh, that was me. Carrot, anyone? Oh, yes. Yum! Yeah! Oh, yes! Thanks, mm. Cat Rat! a surprise game of telephone. The way you play is you listen to my story once and remember as much of it as 
as you can. Gabby is going to tell the story to Pandy and tell him to keep going until everyone has heard and said the story. Then they'll all meet up in my fairy garden at the end of the game to hear the final version of the story and hear how much it's changed. Ready? What's that? Oh, boy. It's a kitty recorder. Ooh, I'm ready for the game of telephone story. Here's the story. Once upon a time, there was a blue flower who decided to go on an adventure outside of the garden. They traveled all the way to the ocean to play in the sand and collect seashells. The end. All right, now I need to find Pandy. Oh, Pandy Paws, where are you? Have you seen Pandy? <laughs> Hug attack! <laughs> <laughs> oh, Pandy. I have a story to tell you. It's for a game called Telephone. Telephone? I'm about to tell you a story, and then you have to remember it as much as possible and find someone else to tell it to. Okay, let's hear it. Hmm, let me think. Oh, yeah. Once upon a time, a red flower went on an adventure outside Kitty Fairy's garden. They journeyed to the ocean and collected seashells. Oh, and if you listened to the seashells, you could hear the waves of the ocean. The end. Whoa, that's a horrific story. Now, who am I going to tell it to? Ooh, I know. Cakey is baking in the kitchen. I'll go tell him. <laughs> Hi, Cakey. You want to play a game? Yes, I just finished baking these muffins. It's the telephone game. Oh, yes, the telephone game Kitty Fairy was telling me about. Yay! Please tell me the story, Pandy. Once upon a time, there was a yellow flower who wanted to go to the ocean, so they packed up all their snackies in their packy. They liked to eat pickles. They went to the sea and collected seashells. Seashells play the sound of the ocean in them. And that's it. The end. Now you should go tell Cat Rat. See you later. All right. Did somebody say my name? Oh, hi, Cat Rat. It's a story Kitty Fairy told us to pass down. All right, let's hear it. Once upon a time, there was a pink flower who ate pickles. They took a green smoothie out of their packy and slurped it. They finally made it to the ocean and collected seashells that played the sound of the ocean. The end. That's it? That's it. Meerkat is next. Once you tell her, come meet us in Kitty Fairy's Fairy Garden. You got it. It's story time. Cat rat style. Okay. Once upon a time, there was a purple flower who drank a pickle smoothie as they journeyed to the ocean to collect seashells. They rode on a pirate ship to reach all the beaches to find all the shells. But along the way, a giant thunderstorm hit. They weathered the storm and safely made it back home with all their seashells. The end. What a stormy adventure. That's the story word for word. Find Pillow Cat, tell her the story, and then meet us in the fairy garden for the big finale. Great. Pillow Cat loves telling stories. And then they rode on a pirate ship to visit all the beaches to find all the shells. But along the way, a giant thunderstorm hit. Is that the whole story? There is one more thing, actually. The flower weathered the storm with the help of singing mermaids, who later gifted a treasure chest full of seashells that if you put them up to your ear, you can hear the ocean. And that's the end. That's a lot of story to remember. Cat Rat said everyone was waiting in the garden to hear the final story. I'll try and remember everything until we get there. There they are! Hey! Hello! Hey guys! Hello, Cat! What's the final story? It's a good one! Once upon a time, there was an orange flower who drank a pickle smoothie as they journeyed to the ocean to collect seashells. They rode on a pirate ship to land on all the beaches to find all the seashells. But along the way, a giant thunderstorm hits. The flower weathered the storm with the help of singing mermaids who later gifted them a treasure chest full of seashells. That if you put the seashells up to your ear, you can hear seagulls. The end. 
Leaping lilies, what a wonderful story. It's different, but it turned out great. Every story needs pirates. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, Kiki. Hi, Gabby. Hi, Pandy. Hi, Cat Rat. We got your note to meet you in the kitchen. What's up? I'm glad you're here because today is a super special day. It's not my birthday. So what very special day could it be? It's pie day! Mm-mm, I love pie! Not that kind of pie, Pandy. Pie is a number that goes on forever and never ends. To celebrate it, we're going to make a bunch of different pies, ones we can actually eat. That sounds amusing. How do we start? There's pie crust in each dish. They just need to be filled. Can I make an apple pie? You sure can. I'll fill a strawberry pie. I'll make a pie in my favorite color, blue. What kind of pie can Cat Rat make with blue fruit? A blueberry pie. Hmm, <laughs> that sounds delicious, Cat Rat. And I'll make a peach pie. Kiki, can we make our pies look like kitty faces? That's a great idea, Gabby. Let's bake you with Kiki. First, Fill your pie with your filling. Apples, strawberries, blueberries, peaches, or whatever you like. Then, cover your pie with a dough circle. You can pinch the top to make kitty ears. And use a tool to draw kitty faces in the dough. Kitty faces in the pies are potastic. Now, let's put these in the oven to bake. That was so much fun. Can we make more? Of course. That's what pie day is for. All we have to do is think of more pies to make. Hmm. Oh, I know one. A chocolate pie. That's a great idea, Cat Rat. Hmm. I'm having trouble thinking of another pie. No problem, Pandy. We can help. Let's think together. Yeah. Hmm. What about a pie you can have for dinner? Yes, with lots of sauce on it and cheese. Sauce? Cheese? Do you know? <gasps> a pizza pie. Great thinking, Pandy. And here's another pie. Fill it with meat and veggies. Hmm, a pie with meat and veggies. Is it a chicken pot pie? That's right. And I already have all the ingredients prepared to pour into our pie dishes. Let's give it a go. To make a chocolate pie, use sugar, cocoa powder, eggs, butter, and evaporated milk to make a chocolate mixture. Then, pour it in the pie and bake. For pizza pie, add sauce and cheese. And don't forget the kitty ears. Then place the pepperoni to make a kitty face. For chicken pot pie, spoon in the chicken and veggie mixture. Cover the pie with dough so you can pinch the top to make ears. Wow, we made so many catastic pies. Now that they've cooled from the oven, we can share them with everyone else. Wait, Kiki, do we have time to make one more pie? Sure, Pandy. What did you have in mind? It's one we haven't made yet, but the worms in the garden would love. Come on. I wonder what that could be. <laughs> there you are, Pandy. What kind of pie did you make for the worms? <laughs> it's a kitty mud pie. <laughs> that is a pie too, isn't it? Whoa, we can't eat it, but I'm sure the worms will enjoy that. Yes, now we really made all the pies for pie day. Woohoo! <laughs> Whoa!
Look, a worm! That worm's enjoying your pie. <laughs> <laughs> hey there, kitty cats. Who's ready to get their groove on? I am. But what music lesson are we going to learn today, DJ Catnip? Well, it's not a music lesson. It's a surprise karaoke party. A surprise? Meowser! What's karaoke? That's when you sing the lyrics to a song. I've got all our favorite songs saved. Let's kick this karaoke party off with the music in you. Follow along with the words and sing with us. DJ Catnip? Do you want to sing next? Sure. Can you play my favorite song, Hey Gabby? I'd like to sing that. Follow along with the words and sing with me. Hey Gabby! You go next. Uh, okay. I think I want to sing the song Living in the Meow. You got it. Oh, I missed my cue. Uh, maybe someone else should sing. Just feel the music, Pandy. You got this. We're here cheering you on. But I don't remember how to sing it all. That's okay, Pandy. Practice makes better. Yeah, you're right. Here it comes! Living in the meow, meow, meow. Living in the meow. Let's get dressed up, make our own movie. When I'm with you, it's all too deep. Living in the meow, meow, meow. Living in the meow. Penny pop up, penny pop up, penny pop up, pop up, ooh, ooh. The penny pop up, penny pop up, pop up, ooh, ooh. Pop, pop. But fun! You did a meowsing! And last but not least to sing, it's me! Play my favorite song, DJ! Firing it up right now! Let's hear it, Cat Rat! This is a ditty about a kitty divine. He puts the me and meow. So ahead of his time. The bravest, most heroic cat the world's ever seen. Spoiler alert! It's me! <laughs> meow! Go ahead and sing it! Meow! It's simple to see! Meow! Well, just admit it! You can't spell meow without me! Ow! Well, that's it! No song is gonna top that one! Oh, Cat Rat! We all got to do something we don't normally do today! Everyone had great catitude! Meow for Kitty Karaoke! Meow! <laughs> <laughs> hey, Cakey! What's cooking? Hi, Gabby! Hi, Pandy! I'm reading a recipe book, and there are so many treats I want to make! What about a smoothie? Or a pizza? Mmm, so many options to choose from! Pillow Cat is about to tell a story. We came to see if you want to listen with us. Ooh, I love story time! Hi, Gabby! Hey! Hi, Pandy! Hey! Hi, Cakey! Hello! Coodle up! Cakey! We have a special story for you. It's about the discovery of a house made of gingerbread. Hmm, what's going on in here? Hey, Cat Rat, we're going into the story closet to discover a gingerbread house. I want to play, too. Coodle up, Cat Rat. Let's yeah. go. Yay! Let's go. Once upon a time, Gabby and Pandy were adventuring in the woods when they 
came upon a gingerbread house. The owner of the house, Cakey, was trying to fix a hole in his gingerbread roof. Oh, it, it's me! Mmm, your gingerbread house smells amazing, Cakey! Hey, what's that? Oh, Pandy, there's a hole in the roof of my gingerbread house and it's leaking frosting. I keep patching the hole with the marshmallow, but every time I check on it, the marshmallow is gone. Oh, ah. it's okay, Cakey. <laughs> well, ah. you. Yep, there's the hole. Cat rat? Hey, Gabby. Cat rat, is that a marshmallow you're nibbling? I found it on top of the roof, just waiting to be eaten. This marshmallow is mine, but the whole house is made of sweets, so there's plenty to go around. Cakey needs the marshmallow to fix his roof, cat rat. Marshmallows are yummy. Oh, why don't we have hot cocoa and marshmallows? We can all share the big marshmallow, and I'll pat the roof with something else. Mmm, marshmallows and cocoa. Thank you. We'll, we'll help, help patch, patch the, the roof. roof. Oh, yeah, me too. Good idea. <laughs> <laughs> and they all drank cocoa with marshmallows in the gingerbread house. The end. <gasps> hey, who wants to make gingerbread houses? Great idea, Cakey. Will there be marshmallows? <laughs> yes, everyone, come on. Let's bakey with Cakey. Potastic. <laughs> Hmm. <laughs> <Ooh. laughs> we did it, Papa. <laughs> it looks just like the gingerbread house from the story. It's dreamy. And you know what comes next? We get to eat it. Oh, my favorite part. Can I eat the marshmallows? Woohoo! <laughs> Thank you for letting me, Pandy, and Baby Box camp out in your garden, Kitty Fairy. You're welcome, Gabby. It's fun to stargaze with friends. Let's lie down and look up at the sky. Wow, look at all the stars. They sparkle in the sky like glitter. Ooh. Awesome. So pretty. Right. Oh, no. I can't see the stars through the clouds. I guess that's the end of our stargazing. We can still stargaze by making our own stars. What do you mean by that, Baby Box? Come with me to the craft room. To the craft room. Ooh, star -tastic. How do you make stars? I'll show you. Let's get crafting. For this craft, all you need is a flashlight or any light source, a hole puncher, a pencil, and a piece of paper. I want to use a black piece of paper to look like the night sky. My hole puncher has a star shape, but any hole punch will do. Wowzers! Flowerific! Ooh! Potastic! Um, you can even use a pencil to poke holes in your paper. Make the holes wherever you like. It's supposed to look like a night sky full of stars. In a lit room, hold your paper and shine your flashlight down over it. Do you see the shadow stars on the table? You can shine your shadow stars on a wall or ceiling. If you want your stars to be bright, then turn off all the lights in the room and hold your flashlight close to your paper. Then the light will shine through your stars and you've made a starry night sky. Let's try out our craft by shining our flashlights through the paper and onto the walls of the room. All right, stargazers, let's give it a go. Let's turn our flashlights on at the count of three. One, two, three. Yay! Shadow stars. Yay! It worked! We're superstars! <laughs> Thanks for helping us stargaze on a cloudy night, baby box. Hey, look! Doodles and doodads! A shooting star! Whoa! It's a shower of shooting stars! Ooh! We saw stars in two very amazing ways! 
And this sleepover gets a gold star. Good night. Bye. <gasps> this is fun. <laughs> Thank you for letting us help with your garden, Kitty Fairy. Yeah, it's so fun to take care of the plants. You're welcome, Gabby and Pandy. We're going to plant special seeds to celebrate a special day. What special day? It's Rainbow Kitty Day. Oh, wow. Rainbows are my favorite. How do we celebrate, Kitty Fairy? It's a day all about the colors of the rainbow. I've planted all different types of flowers to celebrate. If we cover the seeds with dirt and water them, we can watch them grow together. They're amazing. And now, with a little garden magic, Awesome! Wow, they're so colorful! I have an idea! Why don't we make rainbow flower bouquets to give to all our friends for Rainbow Kitty Day? Great idea, Gabby! Thanks, Pandy! Kitty Fairy, could you show us how to make a bouquet? Sure thing! <laughs> to make rainbow bouquets, you need one flower of each color of the rainbow. Red, orange, yellow, green, blue, and violet. Oh, we're missing a color! What color flower do we need for our rainbow bouquet? You're right! <gasps> a yellow flower! Now we have all the colors of the rainbow in our bouquet! Could I make a cat-shaped rainbow bouquet? Great idea, Pandy! I'm going to start by taking three different colors and arranging them in the shape of a cat's face. Then I'll take the other flowers and make eyes and a nose. Add flowers on either side at the top of the bouquet to make kitty ears. That's how you make a cat-shaped rainbow bouquet. Hmm, these rainbow bouquets smell flowerific. I'll gather everyone into the garden. Let's hide with the bouquets so it will be an even bigger surprise. You got it, Gabby. Over there, let's go. A uh, meowsing. <laughs> Hong Kong, we're here. Oh, where are Gabby and Pandy? Maybe they're playing hide and seek? Hmm. Hi, everyone! Happy, Happy Rainbow, Rainbow Kitty, Kitty Day! Day. <gasps> Twinkling Tide Pool, these are gorgeous! I love the colors! We wanted to make these for all our friends who are different and special in their own way, just like the colors of the rainbow. Rainbows are very amazing! And so is friendship! That's right, Kitty Fairy. You helped us grow the seeds into these pretty rainbow flowers. Hmm, <laughs> they smell great, too. Don't forget your bouquet, Kitty Fairy. Thank you. Beautiful bouquet. But uh, since I mentioned hide and seek, can we play, please? Sure, Cat Rat. And I can hide this time. Of course, Cat Rat. Let's all play. Gabby and I will count to 10. All right, kitty cats, we need to hurry and hide. Ha-cha! <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for helping us make the rainbow bouquets. Happy Rainbow Kitty Day. <laughs> Yay! Yay! All right. <laughs> Fantastic. Awesome, kitty cats. The music in you is unstoppable. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> oh, no. DJ Catnip's dance parties are awesome. What a fantastic way to get groovy. Oh. Hi, Pillow Cat. Oh, hi, everybody. Would you like to dance with us, Pillow Cat? Mm, I'm not sure, Gabby. I just woke up from a nap, but I don't feel well rested at all. Oh no! Well, I'm sure there's a way we can help. After all, helping others is a way to show you care about them. What would you like us to do, Pillow Cat? Well, I'm not sure what would help. That's okay. Let's try to find something that makes you happy together. Come on! Cakey's rootin' for you, Pillow Cat. I'm about to play another song, Pillow Cat. Try dancing along to the beat. I'll roll with it. I like your catitude. All right, here we go. Check out this move. Wow, well, this is pretty fun. Way to go, Pillow Cat. Whoa, that was a lot of dancing. It sure was, Pandy. Do you feel better, Pillow Cat? A little bit. That's great, Pillow Cat. And I have another idea. Follow me to the bathroom. Usually, soaking in my bathtub or trying out a new spa treatment helps me relax. 
Why don't we all try a soothing spa party? Woohoo! Spa party! Yes, Let's please! Go. Sure, I'll try it out. When you're finished in the tub, roll on the towel to get dry. <laughs> These cucumbers are so relaxing. Would you like some? Oh, yes, please. Oh, how refreshing. That feels catastic. Oh, I guess I must be really hungry. <laughs> <laughs> I can help with that. Follow me. <laughs> Yummy snacks always fill me with energy. I made these for after our dance party for everyone to enjoy. What did you make, Cakey? Sandwiches! Oh, boy! Mmm, <laughs> these are delicious, Cakey. Aw, thank you. Mmm, yum. Um, may I have another? Yes, of course. I'm glad you like them. Oh, yes, I do. Oh, I feel so much better now. Hooray! But what helped me? The dancing? The spa? The sandwich? Maybe it was all three. And being around friends who care always makes me feel better. Really? Oh, of course. And we care about you, Pillow Cat. Oh, thank you for your help. Everyone, koodle up for a big hug. Hugs! <laughs> Yay! <laughs> I love you guys. <laughs> DreamWorks Gabby's Dollhouse. Meow. Over here, Gabby! Meowzers! That wind is really strong! Hi, everyone! Hi, Kitty Fairy! Have you seen the kitty clouds? The wind is blowing them toward us! Kitty clouds? What are those? <laughs> Look up and you'll see them! Meow! Oh, possum! They're super fluffy! Now those are some catastic clouds. <gasps> oh, wow! Kitty clouds love to make shapes. Looks like they're doing it now. Do you know what shape the kitty clouds made? A triangle. That's right. Oh, they're moving again. What shape did the kitty clouds make now? A star! It's amusing how one cloud can take on many different shapes. What kind of shape is that? Clouds can look like different objects to different people. Let's use our imagination and say what we see. Hmm, I think it looks like a giant pickle. Yeah! I think it looks like a mud puddle in my garden! I see my kitty Floyd napping on his cat bed. See how he's stretched out? I see that. I also see me as a giant cloud. Cloud cat rat! Hacha! What shape do you see in the kitty clouds? You have an amusing imagination. I can see that too. There's the wind again! Oh no! I wanted to look at kitty clouds for longer! Yeah. Cloud Cat Rat is breaking apart! Oh no! Is there anything we can do? What if I gave us all fairy wings so we could fly up and move the clouds back? Great idea, Kitty Fairy! Let's put Cloud Cat Rat back together! <laughs> Whoa! To the kitty clouds! Ha <laughs> Everyone grab a kitty cloud and mush them into shape. Great thinking, Gabby. This way, kitty cloud. How does it look, cat rat? It looks sort of like me. I know. Let's use the kitty clouds to give it eyes, a nose, and a mouth. Look. Those great kitty clouds are floating by. Let's use those. Yay. Eyes. A nose! And a mouth! That's it! That's me! I want to see too! 
They're amazing! <gasps> Look at that! Bye, kitty clouds! Wasn't that fun? With just your imagination, you can do so many catastic things, like find shapes in the sky. Hey! I see more kitty clouds floating over there! Let's go! Bye! <laughs> <laughs> Hi, Carlita! Hi, Gabby! Hey, Pandy! Are you two ready? Sure, Carlita! Ready for what? Cat Rat and I set up an obstacle course! It's for everyone to get up and move their feet! Here's what you do! You go on the seesaw, down the slide, and weave in and out of three orange cones! Wait, where are the cones? Hmm, maybe we should check around the dollhouse and ask if anyone knows. Great idea, Cat Rat. I was so excited to play, I may have left the cones somewhere. We'll help you find them, Carlita. We can search the whole dollhouse. Beautiful bumpers, thank you. Hey there, kitty cats. Hi, DJ Catnip. We're looking for traffic cones that Carlita may have left behind. Go ahead and look. I'm just cleaning up the music room before going to the obstacle course. The traffic cones are orange and shaped like a triangle. Do you see something orange and shaped like a triangle? Here it is! Great! Let's search another room. See you soon, DJ Catnip. All right, I'll start warming up. Hi, Kiki. Hi, Pandy. Hi, Gabby. I'm making carrot snacks for the obstacle course. What's up? These look delicious, Kiki. They also look a lot like Carlita's missing traffic cones. Any chance you've seen one? Traffic cone? Oh! Does this belong to somebody? Carlita is looking for three orange traffic cones. We've now found two. So that leaves one more for us to find. Maybe Mercat will know. Good luck! Kiki's rooting for ya! Woohoo! Hi, Mercat! Hi, Gabby! Hi, Pandy! I'm finishing up my special spa treatments before going to the obstacle course. Awesome! We're looking for Carlita's missing traffic cone. Any chance you've seen it? Hmm, I don't think so. There we go. I'll help you look. The traffic cones are orange. Do you see anything orange? <gasps> Twinkling tide pools, here it is. Among my potion bottles. Catastic! Let's get these three cones back to Carlita. Bye! See you later! Beep, beep! You're back! Wow, that was fast! Thanks, Gabby! Thanks, Pandy! Hey, cool cats! Hello! Hey! All right, let's get our move on! Running. You can play with us! Jump with us! <laughs> Slide with us! Woohoo! Yay! Yay! <laughs> now, run and weave with us! Spectacular! <laughs> 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 Way to get up and play, everyone! Okay, guys, and now we finish with the healthy snack! I made sure there weren't any more traffic cones in the basket. Thanks, Kiki. <laughs> Hi, Pillow Cat. Wow, that's a big book. Hi, Gabby. Hi, Pandy. Hi, Cat Rat. This is a picture book for my story time game. A story time game? Whatever that is, it sounds potastic. Yeah, how do we play, Pillow Cat? Today, I'm going to read this story aloud. And when I point to something in the book, you have to tell me what it is. Easy peasy mac and cheesy. Play along with us. All right. Koodle up, everyone. Once upon a time, there was a kitty made out of snow. A snow kitty. Snow Kitty was friends with Gabby the Snow Girl. <laughs> that does look like me. <laughs> One day, 
Gabby the Snow Girl and Snow Kitty were playing in the fairy tale garden when Gabby the Snow Girl lost her nose, which was a... Keggy uses that vegetable all the time. An orange vegetable? What could that be? Do you know? It's a carrot. Correct! Snow Kitty and Gabby the Snow Girl looked all around the garden for the missing carrot nose. They looked by the chair, under the bush, and around the... What's that a picture of? Oh, I know, I know! It's a tree! Yes! They looked all around the tree, but didn't find the carrot. Although, they did find a hole in the ground filled with acorns. Suddenly, it began to snow. All of the snowflakes were blue and white. But then, some of the snowflakes were orange. These orange snowflakes were actually bits of carrot. They looked up to see a... Hmm, what animal is that? Do you know? It's a squirrel! Snow Kitty and Gabby the Snow Girl saw the squirrel eating the carrot nose. Gabby the Snow Girl offered the acorns she found in the hole as a treat for the squirrel. The squirrel dropped the carrot and took the nuts. Snow Kitty picked up the carrot and brought it back. Gabby the Snow Girl was so happy. Thank you for bringing back my nose. Gabby the Snow Girl put back on her carrot nose. The end. That was a catastic way to tell a story, Pillow Cat. Yeah, I liked the part when Snow Kitty helped his friend by bringing back her carrot nose. And it made me think that I'm hungry for some... Carrots! <laughs> <laughs> Hi, Baby Box. Hi, Gabby. Hi, Pandy. Would you like to make a craft with me today? Yes. Actually, we're hoping you have a crafty, rific bookmark idea that we can make together. I want to save my place in this possum book. Pom poms and polka dots. I know how to make a bookmark. Fantastic! Let's get crafty. To get started, we need an index card, glue stick, safety scissors, colored pencils, and stickers, or any other decorations you might want to use. How should we decorate them, baby box? Any way you want. I'm definitely going to use these googly eyes. First, we'll cut our index cards in half so they're long and skinny, like a bookmark. Then draw your design. <laughs> I'm going to make a pandy bookmark. For the googly eyes. You just need a dot of glue to glue your googly eyes on. Be sure to let it dry. <laughs> That's a funny face. For my bookmark, I'm going to cover it in lots of stickers. I'm going to decorate my bookmark in rainbow colors with colored pencils. The colors of the rainbow are red, orange, yellow, green, blue, indigo, and violet. Rainbow is my favorite color. Now we're ready to give our bookmark a ribbon tail. Take your hole punch and punch a hole at the top of the bookmark. Slip a piece of ribbon through the hole and glue the ends of the ribbon together. Now I can take a break from reading whenever I want. And not lose your place. Yeah. 
fun. And now, cats and kittens, Pandy Paws <laughs> will <laughs> attempt to save the place in his book with his brand new bookmark. Bookmark, bookmark, bookmark. Okay, hold still, everyone. Here I go. It works. <laughs> 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 Shimmering sea scales! We've been having so much fun playing in the pool, I lost track of time! I need to get back to making more spa potions! Thanks for playing in the pool with us, Murkat! You're welcome! Oh, I should probably bring my rubber duckies inside! Hmm, where are my rubber duckies? There are so many toys in the pool, it's hard to find them! Pandy and I will help you look, Murkat! Thank you! I had four rubber duckies! Easy peasy, mac and cheesy. <laughs> I found one. Here's another. Oh! Here's number three. That means there is only one more left to find. Do you see the last rubber ducky? It's right over here. We found all four. <laughs> for your help. See you later. I want to put my pool float away before I go back inside to play some music, but I can't find it. We'll help you, DJ Catnip. What does it look like? It's a pool float shaped like a music note. Let's pull out all the extra floats so we can find it. Shaped like a music note? Here it is. It was fun moving and grooving in the pool. But now I'm going to boogie on out of here. Let it be noted that you two are awesome helpers. Thanks again. See you later. Bye. Honk and horns. Here's one of my beach balls. You're looking for beach balls, Carlita? Yep, I brought three. So there should be two more around here somewhere. I see one. Toss it over here, Pandy. I'll catch it. Got it. Do you see the last beach ball? It's over here. Thanks for your help. Here you go, Carlita. Great throw, Gabby. See you later. <laughs> What's left in the pool, Pandy? Just these two pool noodles. Oh, <laughs> those are mine. They remind me of pipe cleaners. Or spaghetti noodles! <laughs> I can see how they look like both of those things. Mm. Oh, snippets! These are hard to carry by myself. We'll help you carry them back to the craft room, Baby Box. Thank you! Thanks for helping us find all the pool toys. Look! I grew noodle hair! <laughs> oh, Pandy! <laughs> <laughs> oh. Noodle hair! <laughs> 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 Yay! <Woo> Potastic! <laughs> Yay! Potacular! Going down the dollhouse slide is a catastic way to play. Let's go down the pool slide, too! Great idea, Murcat! Follow me this way to the pool! <laughs> I love pool day! Woohoo! <laughs> Yay! <laughs> Shimmering sea scales! <laughs> Woohoo! <laughs> wow, you swim really fast, Murkat! <gasps> it's my favorite activity! Just kick your tail, er, legs up and down! <laughs> Let's try together, Pandy. Fantastic! Shimmering sea scales! You two are speedy swimmers! Swimming is a meowsing! <laughs> Do you know what would make it even better? Pool games! Yes! Awesome! Did someone say pool games? Hi, Cat Rat. Would you like to play some pool games with us? No thanks, but I'll help as long as I don't get wet. <laughs> 
For the first game, we'll take turns going down the slide. Then, we will swim to grab a flag floating in the water. Ooh, me, me, I'll slide down first. Make sure to walk. Water makes the ground slippery. You don't want to fall. Whoops, oh, right. Thanks, Cat Rat. <laughs> Easy peasy, mac and cheesy. I see the flag in the pool. On my mark, ready, set, go! Yeah, I got it! Your turn, Gabby. I need to kick my legs really fast to reach the flag quickly. Made quite a splash, Gabby! Fish tail five! <laughs> you each got the flag! Catastic job! Uh, meowsing! <laughs> What if for our second game, we take turns throwing the ball through the hole of this starfish pool float? Great idea, Gabby! Let's give it a go! Woohoo! Ha-cha! You did it! You try now, Mercat! All right! Another hole in one! Ha-ha, <laughs> yay! Here I go! Aw! I missed! That's okay, Pandy. Why don't you try again? Okay. Yay! Fantastic! Great job, Pandy! Oh, I thought of another game. Mermaid Zigzag. We can swim through the pool and tag our friends on the other side. I have a mermaid potion that will give you your own tails. Fantastic idea, Mercat. Look at that! Amazing! Acha! Look at that! Mermaids on your mark! Get ready, set, go! Tag! You're it, Pandy! <laughs> go, Mermaid Gabby, go! <laughs> Yay! Phew, those games were lots of fun. I'm tired. Uh-oh, what happened, Cat Rat? It's important to get out of the pool and relax if you're tired. For looking out for me, Cat Rat. I'll relax in this chair. Ah, playing games in the pool with friends is so much fun. I wish every day was a pool day. Me too. It's a perfect day at the pool when I stay dry. <laughs> <laughs> I love the smell of the garden after a rain. Do you think the rain showers will come back, Gabby? I think they're gone for today, which means we can go for our hike. But what do you think, Kiko? <laughs> oh, wow! It's a rainbow! You know what that means. This hike is now a rainbow hike. A rainbow hike? What's that? A rainbow hike is when we try to find items in the garden for each color of the rainbow. I'm excited too, Kiko. Do you know all the colors of the rainbow? I know! Red, orange, yellow, green, blue, indigo, and... um... And violet! That's a kind of purple. Oh yeah! Violet! Do you see anything in the garden that's red? Red apples! Good eyes, Kiko! Now we need to find something orange. Help us look! Do you see anything orange in the garden? That butterfly is orange! Thanks for your help! Red, orange, now yellow! Maybe we can find some yellow flowers! Hmm... <laughs> hmm. Over here, Gabby. These sunflowers are yellow. They also have another color of the rainbow, Pandy. 
Huh? Oh yeah, green. The leaves on the sunflower are green. Yes. And look, those birds are blue. All right, so we have red, orange, yellow, green, blue. Now we need to find something that's the color indigo. Uh-huh. I'm not seeing anything that color. Yet. We haven't found anything that's indigo yet. But let's keep looking. <laughs> Kiko found something. <laughs> Great job, Kiko. That bridge has been painted indigo. Maybe we'll find something violet on the other side of the bridge. That's a catastic idea, Pandy. Do you see anything in the garden that's violet? Look, Kiko found violet grapes. <laughs> Me yowzers, there's the rainbow. We found all the rainbow's colors in the garden and we found a rainbow too. Do you want to go up the rainbow, Kiko? First, I'll rub your heart. And now we can fly! To the top of the rainbow! Look at that! Meowsers! A oh, meowsing! I can't believe we're on top of a real rainbow! Oh, I'm so excited! Let's hike across it and see where we end up! Great idea, Pandy! Let's find out! Terrific! Wow, everything looks different on a rainbow hike. Oops, these clouds are blocking our way. Let's try to move them. Can you help us, Kiko? <laughs> Yay! Bye, <Hi>, clouds! <laughs> <laughs> Whoa! We'll have to slide the rest of the way down the rainbow. Hold on! Oh, oh boy! <laughs> <laughs> wow! That was awesome! I love rainbow hikes and rainbow slides! <laughs> <laughs> Hi, Baby Box! Hi, Pansy! Hi, Gabby! Aw, the hamster kitties look like they're having fun. Yes, they're always looking for places to explore and play in. I'm sure they'd love something new then. What if we build them a fort? Oh, great idea, Gabby. We can build using craft supplies. Fantastic. Let's see what's in the craft supply box. Uh-oh, it's empty. That's okay, Pandy. There are lots of items in the dollhouse we can reuse for our craft. To make our fort, we'll need these supplies. A paper plate, popsicle sticks, four toilet paper rolls, and a piece of old fabric. Cakey should have a paper plate and popsicle sticks. Let's go visit him in the kitchen. Good thinking, Pandy. Let's go. Hi, Cakey. Hey. Hello. Hi, everyone. We were wondering if you have a paper plate and popsicle sticks we could borrow. We'd like to make a craft. We're building the hamster kitties a fort. Sprinkle Riffin, I have a paper plate, but I don't have any popsicle sticks. Oh, snippets. Because I already used them to make these popsicles. Let's eat the popsicles, and then you can reuse the sticks. <laughs> Yum. Thanks, Cakey. We'll rinse our popsicle sticks off and use them to build a ladder for the hamster kitties to climb up the fort. Here's the paper plate. I'd love to see the fort when it's finished. Thanks, Cakey. What else do we need, Baby Box? Four toilet paper rolls and a piece of old fabric. Oh, you know, Murcat will probably have the toilet paper rolls. To the bathroom! Hi, Murcat. Hi, everyone. Great timing. I just finished dusting off my potion bottles. Awesome! We're making a fort for the hamster kitties. Do you have four empty toilet paper rolls we could use? 
I'm sure I do. But since I'm cleaning at the moment, they could be anywhere. That's okay, Mercat. We can find them together. Do you see any toilet paper rolls? Let's look. Hmm. There are two over here. One is up here. Oh, here's another one. Great work. Thanks for your help. Now we just need a scrap of fabric. Will this work? I used it to dust my potion bottles. You can have it. That's perfect, Mercat. Thank you. Now we can make our hamster kitty fort. Woohoo! <laughs> Yay! Let's see how the hamster kitties like their new fort. Count with us. One, two, three! Here you go, hamster kitties. Very own fort to play in. We searched for supplies and made the fort together. Aw, look at them go! So cute! Oh, they're having so much fun! What if we crafted a fort for ourselves? Great idea, Baby Box! Let's get crafting! <laughs> <laughs> I'm liking this paint color! Just needs a little sparkle here! <laughs> This is so much fun! Look, there's Gabby! Hug a jack! <laughs> Hi, Candy! Hi, everyone! What are you painting? Hi, Gabby! My cupcake cousins are visiting, and everyone wanted to decorate the dollhouse for when they come over! Yeah, and I had the idea to decorate flags and hang them all around the dollhouse! I painted a superhero pickle! See? It looks great! What a fun idea, Pandy! We're painting our flags to show what we like and who we are! Isn't it very amazing? I painted some flowers! What a catastic flag, Kitty Fairy! Can I paint too? Of course, Gabby! I made sure there's enough paint and paintbrushes and a flag for everyone to paint on! I painted polka dots on my flag! <laughs> That's super cute, Baby Box! Hmm, I'm not sure what I want to paint! Yet, but maybe looking at what everyone else has painted will inspire me. <laughs> You've painted a book, Pillow Cat. Oh, well, yes, because I love coodling up with books and telling stories. That's so you, Pillow Cat. I painted shimmering seashells. Do you like it? It's beautiful. And shiny. But you're sure to love my flag. Wow, Cat Rat. I like how you chose to be different by changing the shape of your flag. It fits more Cat Rat this way. <laughs> my sprinkle flag is ready. Nice, Cakey. What did you paint, Carlita? I painted tires because I love how they take me anywhere. Awesome idea, Carlita. I need to let my music flag fly. It's going to boogie in the wind. I'll hang all the flags up on the dollhouse. I've got to work on my flag so I can hang it up, too. We'll help you, Gabby. Thanks, Pillow Cat. But, hmm, I'm still not sure what to paint. Well, you love coodling up in the bedroom to listen to a story with the rainbow curtains closed. Oh, and rainbows! You love rainbows! And all of us! You're right, Pandy. I love rainbows and my friends. Can everyone help me paint my flag in rainbow colors? You got it, Gabby. Pom-poms and polka dots! That's pretty! It's not finished yet! I love rainbows, and I love my friends. My friends make every day a catastic adventure. <gasps> oh, thank you, Gabby! We love you, too! Now I'm ready to hang my flag. Beep, beep, I can help with that. What if 
tied the flags to my bumper, and I drove around. Then they'd wave in the air. Great idea, Carlita. Yay! Thank you, Carlita. Let's lay the flags out in a line. Okay, they're ready. Here I go. Wow, look at them wave. <gasps> Yay! That's my jam. So shiny. Yay! Whoa. Look at them go. Wow, <laughs> terrific. Hi, everyone. I'm looking for Pandy. Oh, Pandy Paws, where are you? Do you see Pandy? <laughs> Hug attack! <laughs> <laughs> Hi, Pandy. I'm glad you're here. Everyone is waiting to play a game with you. A game? <laughs> Lead the way. Where is everybody, Pandy? They're here. All the Gabby cats are hiding in these boxes. The game is for you to guess from clues who is in each box. Guess which Gabby cat is in each box? I don't know if I can do it, but I'm going to give it a go. Awesome! Now close your eyes, count to five, and I'll hide in one of these boxes too. The clues are on top of each box. Oh, meowzing. Okay, here goes. Count to five with me. <laughs> one, two, three, four, five. I love to bake, and every day is a sprinkle party. Oh, I know who this is. It's the dollhouse cupcake cutie. It's Cakey. You got it, yay! Cakey's rooting for ya. Thanks, Cakey. Garden magic comes naturally to me. Can you guess who's inside? I'm going to say it's Kitty Fairy. <laughs> I like this game. Who's next? Music is my groove. I play lots of instruments, like the tuba and the xylo sofa. Shout out the answer with me. It's DJ Catnip. All right. Yeah, Gabby. <laughs> Toodle up for this clue. I love reading and acting out all kinds of stories, but most of all, I love taking cat naps. Stories, naps, pillow cat. I love making crafts. My mama helps me make things sometimes. Hmm, do you think it's Pandy? Of course, it's Baby Box. <laughs> Doodles and doodads! I'm glad you got it right! <laughs> I like shiny things. You can't spell meow without me. Shiny? Like water? Do you think that's Mercat? I definitely don't like water! Whoops! That's Cat Rat! What gave it away? <laughs> Your voice. My world is full of bubbles, spa science, and shimmering sea scales. Now that's Mercat. Oh, I'm giving you a fishtail five. <laughs> <laughs> Only two boxes left. Anywhere you want to go, I'll take you there. Beep, beep, meow, meow. Who do you think it is? Is it... Carlita? Vroom vroom! You're almost at the finish line! <laughs> I like pickles. And Gabby is my best friend. Aw, candy paws. <laughs> Hug attack! Again! You got all of them right, Gabby! That was an amusing game. Thanks for playing our game with us, Gabby. Thank you for playing, too. See you next time. Yay! <laughs>
How's your yarn craft coming, Pandy? Good, but I thought I had yellow yarn somewhere. I want to use that to make the sun. I think DJ Catnip has some yellow yarn. I'll go ask him. Huh, I really thought I already had some yellow yarn. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa! Wow, so this is what Pandy has been up to. Hmm, where is Pandy? Oh, Pandy Buzz! Do you see Pandy? <laughs> Yeah. Hug a check! Woo! Pandy! You're in there? Yes! I'm all wound up! Here, let me help you get out. Whoa! 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 I'm getting dizzy! We found a lot of yarn that you can use, Pandy! Yeah! <laughs> Shimmering sea scales! Oh, snippets! This is a new kind of jam session! A little help here, Gabby! I'll get you all out! Ah! Hmm. There has to be a better way. Oh, my tail is stuck in a tangle of blue yarn. Blue yarn? I have an idea. Mercat, grab onto that blue yarn and don't let go. Okay, Gabby. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> I'm free. Yes. DJ Gatnip, what color of yarn are you stuck in? I'm in some red yarn. <gasps> red? Ooh, I can help too. Great! Let's pull together! Wow! You wiggled open a new path for me! Thank you! There's some purple yarn wrapped around my paws! Hold on to that purple yarn, baby box! Doodles and doodads! You did it! Pandy, you're next! Whoa! What color yarn are you close to, Pandy? Uh, yellow! It's yellow! All right, everyone, let's pull Pandy out. Let's boogie. Heave ho! We can do it! Woo! Thank you, everyone. And hey, yellow yarn! Now I can finish my craft. <laughs> That's great, Pandy. But first, hug attack! <laughs> <laughs> DreamWorks Gabby Stallhouse. Whoa! I love what Cakey's done with the place! Cakey? Where are you, buddy? I'm under here! Help! Oh! Hang on, Cakey! <gasps> oh, thank you! No problem, buddy. What happened in here? Well, Cat Rat came by with a glitter globe. Then I heard all kinds of silly sounds. The next thing I know, I'm covered in glitter sprinkles. Uh-oh. Cat Rat must have picked up the mixed glitter globe and shook it up. Now my whole kitchen's covered in glitter sprinkles? This is going to take forever to clean up. It's okay, Cakey. We'll help you clean this up. <laughs> you will? Of course. Then we'll find Cat Rat and make sure he doesn't shake that thing again. Hey, check out my moves. Sweet sweep style, Bandy. Sweep style? Oh, yeah, look at that. I'm sweeping. In style. Pandy, that's a catastic idea. We can use our sweep styles to clean this kitchen up fast. I have just the thing. Put these sponges on your feet. Oh, boy. Yay. <laughs> Show me your sweep style. He shoots, he scores. Sweeping glitter off the floor. Show me your sweep style. Cleaning up can be demanding. Almost done. Gotta stick the landing. Show me your sweet style. Taking clean to the extreme. I'm flipping over this glitter pile. See what I mean? Show me your sweet style. Yes, did it. Oops, sorry. Okay, now we just need to figure out what to do with this giant pile of glitter. Well, we just sweep styled it off the floor. I can't put it on my cookies. <gasps> that gives me an idea. Cookie hair. Now check this out. Meowzer, I love this dollhouse. I think these cookies could use some glitter sprinkles, don't you? <sighs> the glitter sprinkles stuck to the cookie. You try this one. Ready? Blow! <gasps> so pretty! 
All right. To get rid of this giant pile, we're going to have to all blow together. On the count of three, blow. Count with us. One, One two, two, three, blow! Ooh! Whoa! Sparkly cookie wallpaper? Oh, it's like a dream come true. Nice job. Oh, these look good enough to eat. Oh, that reminds me. Who wants a cookie? Don't mind if I do. A little snacky for my packy. Yum. Yum. Thanks for cleaning up with me. <laughs> <laughs> Look, Pillow Cat is already asleep. We all love a good cat nap. Not me. Sleepovers are for staying up late with my friends. Me too. Kitty cats, let's play a game. <laughs> Yay! Oh, boy. Yay! I have a game idea. I'll cover my eyes while everyone hides under the blankets. When I touch your blanket, tell me a clue about you and I'll guess who you are. A guessing game. I'm revved up for that. <laughs> when I'm hidden, you'll never guess me. Ha-cha. I'll turn around and count to five. Will you count with me and help me guess? One. Huh? Here we go. Oh. <laughs> two. You can go over here. Three. Oh, maybe here? Four. <laughs> five. Found you. Now the question is, who? Wiggly, wiggly, wig. I know who always says that. Do you? It's DJ Catnip. You know it. Wiggly, 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 wiggly. wig. Okay, next one up. This one. Put a pom-pom on it. Who likes pom-poms? <laughs> That's Baby Box. Doodles and doodads. You're so good at this game. Thanks, Baby Box. Okay, let's find out who's under this blanket. Cakey's rooting for you to guess. It's Cakey. Oops, I said my name in the clue. <laughs> <laughs> and who is this lump? Hug attack! Someone who loves to hug attack? Let's say his name together. Pansy Paws! Yup! <laughs> Aw, hi, Pandy. There are still a few more Gabby cats. Like this one. If you guess who I am, I'll give you a fish tail five. I know who has a fishy tail. Do you? It's Murkat! <laughs> That's me! And who are you? Whoa! The best at hiding! A covered cat! A master of disguise! Hmm... Do you know? Hacha! Oh, I know who it is! That's Cat Rat! The one, the only, the cat rat. Hi! <laughs> Can't spell hide without hi. Hi, cat rat. And who is this? Leaping lilies, it's me! Leaping lilies. Hmm. Lilies are flowers that grow in a garden. A fairy garden. Who could that be? Do you think she has fairy in her name? Like kitty fairy? It's a flower ripping guest. <laughs> There's another lump over there. Okay, mystery guest. Your turn. Honk, honk, and vroom, vroom. Do you know who it is? I think it's Carlita. Yep, you got it. Hmm, is that everybody? I recognize that snore. Still taking a cat nap. Could it be Pillow Cat? <gasps> What? Did I sleep through the game? <laughs> Let's play again. This time, I'll be it. Thanks for playing with us. Bye. <laughs> hey. Hi, Baby Box. We're so excited to craft with you today. Hi, Gabby. Hi, Pandy. Hi, Cat Rat. We're going to have a crafty rhythmic time. I can't wait to hear what kind of craft you have planned. Today is an extra special day because we are going to choose our craft based on upcycling. Upcycling? What's that? A 
It's making something new out of something used, like this coffee mug. Hmm, but that mug is cracked. That's right, Pandy. But this mug can still be reused for so many things. You could turn it into a pot for a plant or a new craft. I brought a whole box of stuff we can reuse for our crafts. I get it now. Do you have anything shiny? Oh, this plastic bottle could be a rocket ship. Phew! Whoosh! If I paint this, it'll be ready to fly in no time. I'm going to paint this egg carton to make another home for the hamster kitties. Whoa! I think they'll like that. Let's get crafting. First, gather up your upcycled materials and painting supplies. I'll start painting my plastic bottle into a rocket ship. It's gonna go straight to the catosphere. Shoo! I'll paint this egg carton purple. The hamster kitties will have fun resting in here. These old buttons were going to be thrown away. I'll paint them yellow and glue them onto the egg carton. Ooh, and since hamster kitties like soft things, I'll take my safety scissors and cut up this old sweater I grew out of. Now the hamster kitties have cushy little seats. I want my upcycled craft to be a musical instrument. I'll make a banjo. First, I'll string the rubber bands on the lid and tape them down. Then I'll also tape the popsicle stick to the flat surface of the lid and decorate it. I'm drawing on kitty paws. This looks potastic. And it sounds cool, too. All your crafts look great. I need to make mine now by using my imagination. I like your catitude, Cat Rat. These rolls remind me of parts of a castle. And I can use this box as the base of my castle. It's perfect for the Cat Rat. Ha-cha! Our upcycled materials include a box, paper towel rolls, then some tape, paint brushes, and paint. I'm going to paint my castle blue, like me. Then I'll tape the paper towel rolls to the box. I also love this aluminum foil left in the box. Shiny is miney, but how should I use it in my craft? You can make windows with the foil. Or a shiny roof. Or flags on top of the castle. I love all those ideas. Thanks for your help, everyone. Sure. Sure! I finished it! Thanks for teaching us how to make crafts out of reused items, Baby Box. And helping us learn what upcycling means. Thanks, everyone! The hamster kitties seem to love them, too. Aww. They're so cute! <laughs>